Hello everyone, my name is Chi Muchi and welcome back to another episode of Silent Hill. In the last one we managed to get all of the plates so that we can put into this door and um, we're going to figure out how to do this. I'm going to try and figure out how to do this. So, okay, so there's like, there's a thing here that's obviously part of this little riddle. It's locked. Okay, so, there are four square indentations. Okay, so, can I just have a look? Uh, so that's where our four plates are going to go in. Right, okay. So, uh, do I need it? I think I need a piece of paper. I think I do. Let's have a look. Do I have a pen? I hope I have a pencil. Here, yeah, do I have a piece of paper anywhere? Uh, yes, I do. Of course I do. I always have it. Because I'm at my art table as well as my let's play table. <laughs> so, of course, I'm going to have some form of writey thing. Anyway, so if I do if I do the little picture. Okay, so it's like it's like a cross. Okay. And then we got these four ones. Okay, so that's my little picture. Can you see it? No, you can't see it, can you? No, you can't see it. You can't see my mental drawing. <laughs> that's sad. Okay, so um we have white at the top, so white. Then we have black, grey, grey, black, just black. Then we have orange. Then we have violet, violet, purple. I would say, I would say lilac. Oh, oh, there we go. We have to choose. Okay, don't push that. Not once again. <laughs> so now we have to go to. Why does everything seem so much lighter? Like that. You just lighten up the face. No, I do. Of course. Um, everything just seems to have gotten like ten times lighter, and I don't know what. I think it is the piece of paper. Okay, so clouds flowing over a hill, which is what I would say would be the white. So this is the first one. So one. Sunny sky on a sunny day. So that's blue. So the blue, the turtle, the but the blue goes somewhere. Okay, so I'm thinking blue goes in the that corner. The, the right corner, the right top corner, so blue. But then the bottom one is the tangerines, which are orange, and that's below that one. Lucky for us, so that one's green. Violet, see I told you it was violet, not purple. So now we got so dandelions along a path, which will be, what was the other colour? I got a cat, which was yellow. And then... Unavoidable sleeping time, which is black. And then liquid flowing from a slashed wrist. Which, the Queen of Hearts, I thought that was pink. Oh, I've got colour blindness with pink and red, I'm telling you. I know I don't, but oh well. So that's one. So okay, so that's my little drawing, which you won't ever see because you can't see it because the light is just too much. Okay, so let's see that there for a minute. It does, doesn't it? It lights it up. Oh, weirdly paper. Maybe it's angelic paper. Okay, so Okay, so I have, I have to actually use them. I, I can't just, you know Put it, okay, so that's pink. That's well and truly pink. Okay, so what was it? it was blue? Put my headphones in a bit more because I can't hear bushes. Oh, no, I can't hear my own voice, so I might shout. I want to put it here Why does it have it? Why does it have to put turtle because that just confuses me the cloud, and then there's a blue turtle. Makes sense. And the yellow one goes in the bottom left hand one. Like so. Uh, then, oh, I keep clicking on it. Because I'm stupid. Oh. oh. I don't want to move anything. I'm happy with my judgement. Here, okay, watch it be completely wrong now, and I'll just be like, huh. So sad. Okay, so. I want to put it in here. And then the other one, which is apparently it's red. I wouldn't have said so, but hey ho. Who am I to change the ways of the silent hill? And in that one. See now it does kinda of look red. Yes, did I do it? Get in. Oh shit, I didn't even expect this. What a lovely uh Meeting place this is, madame. Oh, no. 
I'm just going to pull out my headphones just a little bit because I can literally hear nothing else but myself. <laughs> it's just a little bit too loud. Knowing your headphones are like right in your ear and you can literally hear your own heart beating. That's what it was like. Oh, I hit her by accident. Sorry, miss. You shouldn't get in the way of my swing. If you get in the way, you'll get hurt. I'm just on the rebound. I'm sorry. Close your legs over when you're dying. Die with dignity and grace. They're shriveling up like a... Um... Okay. Okay, so... I want to go into the operating prep room. That sounds pretty cool, doesn't it? It does. Okay, so... Where the hell? Oops! Which way? Oh, this way! Hello. Hello there, stranger. Like, what? Oh, what? Where was your leg, stupid man? Which way are you wearing, like, a skirt? Oh, that end. No, he's not a skirt. Come at me, then. Why? How do the doctors die? Do the doctors die in the same way? They're not too bad because they've got pants. Oh, hello. There's a lot of their nurses, aren't there? Get out my way. I'm like a steamroller. Just put them out of the misery. Ooh, there's a key. Well, that music's a bit, uh, a bit alive. Oh, the basement story. I knew that story had something good in it. Well, she did all that for that. Oh, I'm in the operating room. So people got operated on the knee. That's a scary concept. Oh god, I have to go all the way round. <laughs> uh, what? These controls are beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, so. Uh, I just want to go and explore the other ones. I want intensive care unit. Oh. Oh, we can go in there. Where is it? Oh my god, where is it? Oh, that's so scary. Head looks like so long. This isn't a very good intensive care unit. It's like a bed in the middle of like. This like intensive care unit is kind of so cool. I've only been to intensive care unit once. Not me personally. I'm gonna go see someone. And god, it was like complete lockdown. It was like you could only go in if you do like certain things. You have to like proper wash your hands, and I mean like you have to wash them with soap and water, and then you had to use the alcohol. And you had to do loads of other stuff as well. It was just like, oh, okay. And there's the amount of like stuff that they put on people in there, it's unreal. Like Oh, is this a video? Got a medical pack. Medical pack. But yeah, the amount of uh, tubes and stuff that they have is unreal. I wonder if you could just literally completely survive on the intensive care thing. I don't know if you can but wouldn't that be weird if you could just literally just sit there and your body just gets like done for you because if you think about it like your heart's beating every single day of every single minute and every single second and you're breathing so if one of them was to just kind of shut off then you'd be up shit street if you went into intensive care it must just do it for you i'm rambling i'm rambling i know i'm rambling <laughs> But uh, I don't think it would help your brain very much. I don't think they've got a machine that can uh, keep your brain alive or going. Or you can have a machine if your heart stops working. You know, it kind of gets bad, kinda, like damaged, to make it better. But there's no machines that can go in your brain to make you make brain damage go away. I d I'm literally I don't know what I'm saying. I know what I'm thinking. <laughs> You know, <laughs> but I don't know what I'm actually saying. Like, if your lungs start failing, you can kind of have machines and stuff to help. But if your brain starts 
failing then there's no chance to lose yourself as a person Oh, the shotgun shells. I'll take them. Thank you very much. Was that it in here? Why? No, there's a door. Is it? It's in here. There's... Oh, okay. So can I move this cabinet? I didn't realise that I could have moved it. Oh, thank God. I just kind of checked. Okay, so there's a door. Okay, where... where... Oh, I'm still in the storeroom. Nothing unusual here, no. Just things completely covered in blood. Looks like a hallway under the grate. Can't move it since the vines have grown around it. Is that lighter going to come in handy? Are we going to burn these vines away? We are. I best bet still have that lighter. The fire goes out as soon as I try. Ah, and then we use a disinfectant alcohol, I'm guessing. Right. Because alcohol sets on fire quickly, doesn't it? You watch, it'll just fail now. Right, where is it? Alright, calm down. Don't pour the whole bottle. We might have a cup that we need to disinfect. You know what I'm saying? I have loads of uh, disinfecting alcohol. They're actually pretty good, and like with the artsy stuff. With the watercolour. It's cool, and then with sculptures. It just like smooth the clay out. And on it makes like. Oh no, it worked. It makes like a maze and a uh, patterns on watercolour. Because the water and the colour kind of spread out. I know what it does. <laughs> uh, do we still have that lighter? These people are just fucking stupid. You, why do you just throw the lighter away once you've used it? Keep hold of it. You may need it. That flashlight ain't gonna last forever. And you've got more chance of using your lighter than you have of a battery. I'm so stupid. Hello there, young, young lady. You no, know, you really shouldn't hit people with knives. It's uh, dangerous. You could hurt someone. You could slash someone's eye out. Oh, hello. And you too. Where did these... Why, why do nurses have like... Right. Harry, 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 Harry. Harry, hurry. Hurry up. Oh, and just... Me, uh... Me priest. What a buttons kind of, uh... Shit. Oh. Is there many doctors about? <laughs> nah, that's like any normal hospital though, isn't it? <laughs> right, so are we done? Are we quite finished? I don't have a map of this place. Okay. Okay. Oh god. Hello there. Hello. Please don't grab me. Can you not? Can you just... See, the shotgun is really good for these kind of uh, situations, but I'd rather not use it. Oh, they're teaming up on me! Oh. I, I, it went through. I, I, I just, okay. I hate it when this happens. Right, back off. Oh, oh. oh. that shot is so annoying. So annoying. There's no need for it. My hammer should have well and truly got them. You're dead. You're dead. Good. Okay. Want to Okay. Oh. Oh. Stay down, love. Oh. Best if you do. Oh, there's a tape. A videotape. Remember back in the day? Back in the day, we'd used to watch them. We used to go around. And then the whole black stuff would come out, and you'd have to, like, Get a screwdriver to twist it back in. I'm sure I've had this before. It's reminiscent. And when you used to like see like oh what are they called? You know the West where they have them weird balls. Oh god. What? I feel like this is like a bad room. <laughs> like, you know the rooms where you're like gonna die. Yeah, what are they called? Moss balls. And they're just like, you know, fluttering in the wind. Well, there used to be like, tape, stuff of that. Alright, this, this conversation just ended. It's just not making any sense. What's this? The bed. It seemed like a million more of them.
Looks like someone's been here. Alessa. Ah, so this is Alessa's room. Well, there's a key. Get a note. I don't care about the picture. There we go. An examination. Oh, okay. Where's the examination room? Oh, I know you don't have a map of that place, but I want to see the map of the other place. Oh. What was wrong with her? Like, what happened to her? I can't remember. Didn't she have to be put on, like, life support? For some weird reason. Like, something really bad happened to her. I can't remember, you know. I really can't. So that's Alessa. That's the girl that's obviously bed. What's a bed? What's it doing here? Who would? Harry. You're in literally like a nightmare world, and your main concern is that there's a bed in the wrong room. Harry. <laughs> you do worry me sometimes. Ah. Okay, so. uh, it's locked and it can't be moved. So I have. Have I explored? It's locked and it can't be moved once again. I think I've been in here. No, no. Okay. So is this. Is this the glass room? I don't trust it. Because I know in Silent Hill there's always a room that you can't get out of and it, you just die. I don't fancy dying, I haven't saved it in any way. Okay, can I go out now? Because I've got, I've got a key and I've got the video. Shit. Can I go back up with it again? Okay. Go up, it? That would be stuck. Can I? Yes. Ooh. Ooh, hello. What, what? Oh, yeah, I'm back in the store. Okay. Hopefully there's no more doctors about, because that would be rather bad. E video killed the radio star. And DVD killed the video. And then the internet's just killed all forms of media. <laughs> uh, yes. So, what was it I got? A key. And a video. Okay, the video is on room 302, so... I'm gonna go and see the video first, and then I think I'll end this episode. And then I'll go to the key in the... Where's the examination room? Ah, right, it's that room that had a noise in it. Scary, scary stuff, I don't want to know what's in there, to be honest with you. Okay, so it's the third floor. Video killed the radio star. Where's the, like, the lift music? There is none. Ah, so that's the biggest tragedy of this game. There's no lift music. Okay, so now I want to go to the video room, which is, um, across the way. Oh, oh. oh god, I'm, I'm stuck. Of course. Why would, why would we not have half the floor? Why would it be missing? <sighs> Strange questions. It will never be answered. Okay, I'm thinking it's this one. I might have gone in the completely wrong room. No, this one's got a birdcage in it, which... Apparently to Harry isn't really useful because he hasn't written it down on the map. So do we have to find a bird? Or is this bird just not important? Okay, I'm going to save it. I am actually going to save it because if I die or something cuts off, then I will not be impressed. I'm going to be invited. It'll be fine. And if not, then I can just do all the stuff again, can't I? Like I've done about four times already. Oh yes, I know it's usable. Oh yes, I have to actually go into my inventory and click it. But nothing on the label. Found on the second floor hospital basement though. That wouldn't oh god. It was recorded on a potato. Don't forget. I 
like I can't hear other things that what you were saying instead of there. Oh, oh, I think I figured. Alessa was burnt, wasn't she? I, I can, I'm just thinking about the movie because I don't remember the game. I'm sure the game's a lot different. If I can remember rightly, Alessa was burnt. All of her skin was burnt. Or maybe when she was changing her bandages, she just, it wouldn't stop. And that she was just a child. Who was saying that though? Was it one of their people? Can't remember. I know Alessa was burned. Oh yeah, and she was put on a life support machine. Because she was burned. Why was she put on a life support machine? Because I'm sure they couldn't fix the burns. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I'm sure I'll figure it out. Anyway guys, I think I'm going to end this episode. Oh, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like or a comment in the section below. And I think I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye guys!